In this video, you will learn how to navigate from model space to paper space and how to set the page size and how to create viewport and scale the drawing in the viewport. To start with this video, just check that in your drawing have the model and layout space. If the model and layout is not exist in your drawing, you need to turn on that. Go to option, write OP, enter and under the display tab you will see there is a uh, layout element display layout and model tab if this is unchecked um, the model and layout will, will not be in your drawing so you need to this checked supply ok and you can also turn this on off by going to view and you can see there is a layout and layout tab and also the file tab you can turn on and off from here so you need both if you go here you can see there is a layout on and layout 2 and also you can see there is layout on and layout 2 go to this layout on and layout 2 and first create a layer new layer say viewport close this one and go here and make the viewport as a current layer click this so viewport is now current is the current layer and now you can see there is a white preview of page you need to set this page and if you double click on any layout you can see there is some option by going to page set um, page setup manager you can change that and if you go here you can see plot option and publish option but there is no page setup manager and you can go to output and you can also click here to the page setup so click page setup manager and the page setup manager is on and in the under layout one click modify and you can see there is a printer and plotter list so if you click in the drop down list you can see there are lots of um, plotter uh, related with this autocad and if you have any installed um, plotter or printer you can see the list here as i have the installed canon ix670 series and from the list select this one dwf6e plot pc3 to make electronic output and from this paper size click ARC, arcd 3, uh, 36 into 24 inches select this one and you can see a preview here which is 36 inch wide and 24 inch height and the scale should be one by one because in model space and the pra in, in practical the drawing should be one by one and if you have the decimal setting then you here should be millimeter but I have the uh, architectural setup so it should be inch and now click ok and when you have clicked ok you have seen that the white space has been changed now click close and you can check by going to home and click approximate location here and here uh, there is uh, another point and you can see that it is 3 feet so 36 inch wide now to create viewport type m b m view enter and create a rectangle uh, create a rectangle click this point and say click this point the viewport is created and the drawing you see is from the model space so you can double click here and you can see uh, and you can pan or move the drawing and when you your cursor is under this mod model space you can see it is a cursor shape is cursor and when it is in outside then it is a arrow so double click in the paper space to activate this viewport and I can change I can set the scale from here double click on this viewport and from this lid you can set the scale and in the upper side there is a decimal scale and in the lower side there is a uh, inch speed scale so I don't know what should be the scale but I can try try with quarter inch scale so it seems that it is very small in the sheet so then try half inch scale but it is too large related to this drawing so try an intermediate scale say 3 by 8 but it is not also fitting so I think the quarter inch is the final so this is scale and double click outside and if you go to this viewport 
and if you just scroll your mouse or zoom the drawing the scale has been changed so it is very dangerous if you zoom the drawing going to this model is from the viewport and uh, zoom the drawing and now you can try say z enter and enter and you can set the drawing with an approximate that it is perfectly scaled but this is not in the perfectly scale to make this proper scale you need to go to here in the list and say quarter is inch and now double click in the paper space so the drawing is now in quarter scale and to prevent this the changing of the scale of the viewport i can lock the viewport double click here and you can see there is a lock symbol so click this lock and now if you zoom the whole window is zooming so you cannot change the scale of this drawing now so double click here now it is done and also i can now if i go to here and i turn the layer off oh, this is current layer just change the layer first say this one and if i go here and i, I change this viewport layer off i can do that so i cannot see the viewport but if i double click here i can see that and double click outside and there is another way if you don't want to off this layer you can uh, change this to not the viewport layer you can you have to change this to dip point so if we have dip point it will not be printed during the uh, printing process and there is another way you can you can change the size of this viewport by clicking here click this one and now if you if you move the grip in any other way other direction the size of the viewport is changing so this way you can change the viewport size and you can lock the viewport and you can cha change this to default or you can keep that in viewport and you can opt that from here the layer up from here this way you can set your drawing in a scale in the paper space in this video you learn how to toggle up any layer in a specific viewport create a new viewport right m view m view and make a small window here and double click and say i want to show this kitchen here and now uh, try to set an scale say happens now try one is so it is fitted the kitchen is here and my current is uh, current layer is beam so need to set b port and also set this one as a b port okay now it is shown but uh, in in this b port i don't want to show this text here so how can i close that this is the room name and if i go here and if i turn off this layer and i can see that the layer is also off from here uh, so it has turned off from whole the window but i don't turn this way so double click and turn on this and if you freeze this it is also same for whole the drawing so this way it is not not possible so double click here and go to this layer properties manager and if you go here you can see there is some new option make maximize all column and you can see there is uh, some new option so vp freeze and if you go the room name and if you click this pp phrase and you can see that sorry uh, we have and now you can see that the name is here but there is no name and in this way i can also close this one so this is room dimension go here and check room dimension so this is room dimension and close this one so it is not here 
so this way you can turn off layer in any specific viewport you can also do this by other way so go to here and just turn on close and now double click outside and go to this main viewport and you can do that in other way by going to in this drop down menu and you can click this viewport freeze in a uh, bp freeze in all viewport except current so click this one and if you click this and this enter and double click here and if you go here you can not see that and what it has done double click here and you can check here that it has done the same thing we did uh, before so this way you can turn off any object in any specific viewport